What's up, enthusiasts? Today we've got a package to open, and this is something that's becoming, well, fairly common on this channel, and uh, I've been getting some requests in the past to asking if I had a P.O. box or not, so I decided, you know what, let's give it a shot. Why don't we open up a P.O. box? So I've got that, I'm gonna put the information on the screen, and it'll be down below in the info below. So before we open this, just wanna talk about that really quick. Anything that is sent to that P.O. box will be opened on camera, so long as it is appropriate. I request you don't send me anything inappropriate. That's, you know, we're a family-friendly channel here. We try to keep it that way. But uh, down below, there'll be info on that, and I look forward to opening Anything that anyone may want to send, um, I, it's, it's a bit of a foreign concept to me, to be quite honest. Uh, I, I, whenever someone brought it up in the past, it was, I, I don't know, why would anyone want to send anything to me? It never really made sense, but we're going to give it a try, and uh, if it happens, if people send things our way, we'll have some fun opening it on camera, testing things out, maybe make some videos, uh, what have you. We're going to give it a go. But one other thing I want to talk about is this right behind me. That is my patch board. I just picked it up. It is massive, much bigger than I expected. And uh, I want to fill that with a bunch of Nerf related or gaming related or anything uh, related to things I enjoy, patches. Uh, I've already got some patches up there right now. I would like many, many more. So it's going to be a uh, recurring thing. I'm going to try and find patches of Nerf companies, Nerf groups. Uh, if you have a Nerf group and have a patch for your team or your organization or whatever, let me know. I definitely want to rock all kinds of different awesome Nerf themed patches. So just wanted to share that with all of you. But now that's enough about all this. Let's go ahead and switch camera views and get to opening that package. All right, here we are. We've got our package. I know who this is from. This is from Heath on uh, the Reddit Discord. And uh, he was talking about sending me something that I am, well, pretty excited about. Let's go ahead and just tear through that with a big old knife. Ain't nobody got time for delicacies. Or let's just use some scissors since that's a whole bunch of layers that I just don't want to deal with. And apparently, oh, did he send me? Oh, Heath. Oh, Heath. You, you are an awesome human being for sending some extra goodies with you, with this. Oh, oh, he sent two? He sent two. Okay. These are scar barrels for the Caliburn. He sent two? Are you kidding, Heath? Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, and they're already strung up and everything. So wait, so as it sits right now, the strings are straight. But I'm assuming if we twist, oh yes, I'm so excited about this. Oh my goodness. We twist and then the strings change their orientation. So got myself a Caliburn right here, a Fabu Burn, which uh, if you missed the live stream for this, Oh, it went on perfectly. There is a bit of a tolerance uh, in these barrels that can change. And I was wondering if I was gonna have to sand this out at all. I don't. That's awesome. I am f I am super ecstatic about this. That's, that's actually on there really well. This is a pretty long scar barrel. It's much longer than normal ones that we have uh, been accustomed to seeing. I'm gonna grab a magazine and we're gonna talk about the other thing in here really quick. Um, it's much longer, but this is something that has been uh, worked on by him, and I believe Thundercronk was someone who talked about it as well, having this length uh, to potentially get better performance. So we're going to test this out for sure. There's going to be a whole video on just these scar barrels in the future, but Heath, thank you so much for sending some half-length darts. I, I have been waiting for my light take order of half-length darts for uh, a while now, and I was actually really bummed because I didn't order the right darts. I ordered a harder tip version of these. These are the, the sweet oranges, I believe. I ordered something more along the lines of FVNs, I believe. And I was bummed because I did that because people have been talking about these that they, they aren't quite the worker accuracy. But with, uh, with a scar barrel, well, who knows? So uh, I'm pretty excited about this. Can't wait to share this with all of you in another video. I'm gonna go ahead and load this up really quick. Just shoot one off and find out because 
Well, I'm excited. Oh my goodness, this barrel is so long now. It is so long. Woo! Woo! That's loud. That's loud. All right. Uh, I may cut a little bit of footage of shooting with the scar barrel, or I may save it for another video, but regardless, Heath, thank you so much. I am so beyond excited right now to get this blaster out to a game, get footage for all of you, and um, just, just share it with all of you because I am so excited. Thank you for the darts. Thank you for two scar barrels. Are you for real? We're going to test, we're 100% going to test the Bradley, uh, I believe, Bradley's theory that the muzzle brake, rather than actual rotations, uh, will provide you all you need for certain tar dart types. So we're definitely going to try that with the two separate scar barrels here. Man, I am, I'm giddy. I am giddy right now. And this, well, this is just exciting. I, I, I don't want to keep rambling though. I don't want to keep it here. Uh, but I am excited to share this in future videos with all of you. So again, if you guys want to have anything opened on camera, the info is down below for the P.O. Box. Um, I appreciate anything anyone wants to send. Uh, don't feel obligated. This is just a fun little thing that, you know, people have asked. So I figured, you know what, let's do it. I don't want anyone to ever feel obligated to send anything or do anything other than just watch and have a good time here. Uh, I want to entertain y'all and, and, and help you guys have uh, better days wherever you're at, whatever you're doing. So thank you so much for being here today, for watching. And uh, as always, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.